All right, Christian Michael here, the Joker there. Here he is, the Joker, New York City Comic Con exclusive from Batman the Killing Joke. I'm going to check him out in the back in all his sadistic glory right there. Now, if you're unfamiliar with what Batman the Killing Joke is, it was a very famous, controversial, I've heard a lot of people toss around, Batman graphic novel, and then they made the graphic novel into a DC uh animated movie over the summer which i caught i haven't read the novel yet people say the novel's better than the movie that's usually what people say that books are better than the movie but i don't like to read i like to watch movies so i saw the movie i like the movie it's just as simple as that okay so here he is like we said new york city comic con exclusive um i believe it was nerd therapy who put out a video of all the new york city funko exclusives and he was the only one that i was excited at about and wanted to get my hands on even though i did pick up the new york city comic con exclusive suicide squad joker because we don't have enough suicide squad exclusive jokers we just don't we just need every suicide squad joker that there was ever made and we won't stop until we get them because just the way it is you just have to get them all all right let's open them up and check them out here now like i, I said in past videos i don't like to uh, review Funko Pops on their own, but you know, we will with special ones, and I think this is a special one here. So let's check him out here. Him in his little, uh, I guess you want to call it a vacation outfit, even though this is what he was dressed in when he showed up to uh, shoot uh, Batgirl, Barbara Gordon, and then did whatever you want to say that he did. I Again, I didn't read the uh, graphic novel. Some people said he raped her. It, didn't exactly play out that way in the movie so i don't really know so there you go you want to take a look at his face x just this just really pops out at you with the colors and it's just one of the brighter like uh attention grabbing jokers uh that funko has made it's probably one of the better ones he's got his little drink there with his camera the shoot i mean this is just this is just excellent this is one of the best pops i own i gotta i just gotta go out there and say that i mean just the colors and the, it's very vibrant especially for the joker who you usually just see him rocking green and purple all the time and then you got him in his his loafers and his socks and the juice and it, i mean it's just great even though this one does have some imperfections you got like a paint bubble right here and on the back i don't know if the camera will pick it up but right above my finger there's just like a splotch of paint just attention to detail, but this this is just excellent. I mean, if you're a Batman fan and the Joker is your favorite villain, I don't know how you don't try to find this. Um, I was told there, this was probably going to leak in stores at some point, but I, you know, I have no luck with finding things like that in my area, so I usually just hit up eBay to get them, and we got him for a bit. We got this guy for about twenty three bucks with shipping, which for uh exclusives not bad to pay about 10 or 12 dollars above retail so i think we got a win there because he's well worth every penny in my book so just, you just want to you just want to just look at him and be like wow you you are really awesome and funko you really really nailed it you can even see the, the palm trees and on the back there the the three tones or the three colors you got the green the white and blue teal whatever you want to call it the purple shorts they did a, a, an amazing job with this joker the killing joke joker i mean whether you loved or hated the uh, animated movie or you read the book this top notch one of my favorite pops uh, that I own, I'm just looking around, he might be my favorite, and I just opened him, that's how great of a job Funko did with this, it just, it just grabbed, like, you, I have all, probably 150 pops all up on this shelf over here, and some of them just blend together, but this guy, he jumps out at you, and he says, you know, those are the special pieces in your collection, when you have so many of a certain type of thing, and they just all seem to blend together when they're displayed. But when one just jumps out at you, that's your special piece. And, you know, obviously he's not up there yet. But I can't imagine him just blending in with the scenery. This is going to be one of those, like, 
people are going to look at it and be like, wow, you know, I'm just looking at all, and that one right there, that one's really cool, and they'll be pointing at him, so, really good job, Funko, with that, very pleased with that, normally a lot of times we do these reviews, and I always find something wrong, or I have reason to hate something, but not this guy, he's a winner, he gets a thumbs up, and speaking of thumbs up, why don't you give this video one of these bad boys right here, Please rate, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much. And uh, follow me on Twitter at Christian underscore 973. And let's put a big old bow. That was me drawing a bow on episode 144. Thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you in the next video.